Pro Stock winner here in the Media Center defeats teammate Alan Johnson in the final round. Jegs.com and Mopar on his Dodge Avenger runs 668 0, 206.20 miles per hour. This is Jegs' first win of the season and 53rd of his career. Also, a second career win here at Heartland Park. Topeka moves Jag into second position in the Mellow Yellow Series points. This morning, you had the air of confidence about you. I got to speak with you for two seconds, yep. and you, you were feeling it at that point. Were you, or were you just talking to them? No, I felt, uh, I felt great, uh, really, all season long. And uh, we've just kind of had our ups and downs as far as why we haven't been able to seal the deal and get a race win. Uh, but again, uh, you know, we tested uh, before we came in to Topeka and Tulsa just up the road and, and uh, worked on some things from a chassis standpoint, worked on some things from uh, my own package uh, from behind the wheel and was really happy with what we came out of there. Uh, ran uh, extremely aggressive all four runs uh, and uh, really felt great coming in, into today. And uh, again, uh, to, get, to get that win, you know, uh, had great reaction times all day. I had slipped a little bit second round was trying to be uh, low 20 and uh, ended up mid 30 and uh, the rest of the day uh, we were set on kill and, and uh, that competition plus Jaggy on the day that you get your 500th round victory which moves you fifth all time amongst pro stock drivers Bob Glidden and Warren Johnson and all the gang there right on. what does it mean to seal the deal with the win well, it feels fantastic you know uh, any day you you're hoisting a wall at the end of the day is 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 what you yearn for without question. Uh, but today was extra special, you know, for a lot of reasons. We haven't haven't won in a couple of years. I took the 11 season off, uh, went winless uh, in pro stock uh, in 2012, and uh, to have the success we've had this year in 2013, you know, with the J and J horsepower, and uh, and and this whole program, to to finally uh, hoist a Wally. Uh, on Sunday is is exactly uh, what the doctor ordered. We uh, don't feel like we've been shortchanged anywhere along the way. We've been working hard, trying to work smart, and uh, today it uh, it was our day, and it uh, it felt. I'm just fantastic. curious. You won so many championships, so many races. You won one other time here. That's been 13 years ago. Do you remember <laughs> anything about that one? You know, I I can't I can't drum. Uh, what is 13 years ago? 2000. 2000. Well, hell yeah, we we're uh, we we're on a tear in 2000. Uh, Went in just about everything there was in sight that year. Had a had a just a banner year, and uh, you know when you win at a at a racetrack for the first time, it's always special, and uh, it almost feels like a first time today. To be honest with you, as uh, as you mentioned, it's been been quite some time. But and Troy won here one time two years after that. Yeah, he busted me in the uh, in the semifinals and came back and uh, won the finals. So I I watched him drive away from me and I was like, damn. <laughs> and uh, and uh, but I was obviously extremely proud for him and uh, and was looking forward to him uh, closing the deal in the final and, uh, of which he did. So uh, we've had good runs here and, and uh, you know the sports had great runs here. You know we we've, we've had great Scott Coletta moments here that uh, come to mind right off the bat. And uh, you know Sean Langdon and I were talking a little bit about that. Uh, you know uh, in the winter circle, just how well the fuel cars run here. This track is so good that. Uh, it's always exciting, so it's great to come here, and obviously it's great to win.